In this video, we want to find what i raised to the 2666th power and i to the 145th power are equal to. Well, notice here that i raised to a power goes in a circle. So we have first i to the 0 is 1, then i to the first is i, i squared is negative 1, i cubed is negative i, and then i to the fourth will be the same thing as i to the 0, which is 1. And then i to the fifth is equal to i. i to the sixth is equal to i squared, which is negative 1. i to the seventh is the same thing as negative i. And then i to the eighth is 1, etc. So that means every four, so it's going to cycle for every four. So the trick here is divide the exponent by four and look at the remainder. And the remainder will tell us where we're at. So if it's remainder 0, it's going to be 1 here. The remainder is 1, it's going to be 1. If it's going to be i. The remainder is 2, it's going to be i squared, which is negative 1. The remainder is 3, it's going to be i cubed, which is negative i. So what is a remainder when I divide 2,666 by 4? Well, the trick here is you can simplify it by just dividing 66 by 4. You, you basically only care about the last two digits. So you can ignore everything else. Now, I know 16 times 4 is 64. So 66 divided by 4 will be 16 remainder 2. So the remainder is 2, which we put it on the exponent. So that's i squared, which is the same thing as negative 1. So i raised to the 2,666 power is going to equal negative 1. Now let's look at i raised to the 145th power. When we divide that by 4, we only care about the last two digits. So let's look at 45 divided by 4. Well, 44 divided by 4 is 11. So 45 divided by 4 is 11 and remainder 1. Now the remainder 1, it goes on the exponent of i. So that's just going to be i. And that's our answer.